Dear straight allies, thank you. More, please. Most everyone is mad here. <laughs> and if your children were born homosexual, what would you do? I mean, obviously, I'd tell them he was adopted. Oh. And I can't change. Even if I tried. Even if I wanted to. And I can't change. Dear straight people, why do I have to prove my love is authentic? Why do I have to prove my love is authentic? Why do I have to prove my love is authentic? Why How am I supposed to explain to my child that two men are getting married? I don't know, it's your shitty kid, you fucking tell him why. All we are doing with this bill is allowing two people who love each other to have that love recognized by way of marriage. And there is a disease lurking in your very neighborhood. And that disease is the gay. Cause I knew you were trouble when you walked in. A preconceived idea of what it all meant But those that like the same sex have the characteristics The right-wing conservatives think it's a decision And you can be cured with some treatment and religion Man-made rewiring of a predisposition Playing God Oh nah, here we go America the brave still fears what we don't know I, I also, sir, had a Catholic priest tell me That I was supporting an unnatural act I found that quite interesting coming from someone who's taken an oath of celibacy for his whole life. God hates gay people. You're straight people. I don't think God is a sexual orientation, but if she were straight, she'd be a dope ally. Why else would she invent rainbows? <laughs> this is fantastic for the people it affects, but for the rest of us, life will go on. When did you realize you were straight? Who taught you? Did it happen because your parents are divorced? Did it happen because your parents are not divorced? Did it happen because you sniffed too much glue in fifth grade? All you need is love. All you need is love. Love. Love is all you need. Paid for by the coalition of people whose lives are ruined whenever other people are treated equally.